Hi, welcome back. A beautiful lens flare can add magic to a photo. Sadly, Affinity Photo has no way of generating lens flares. Either we have to download a lens flare image or create our own. In this video, I will show you a quick way to generate lens flares outside of Affinity. In most cases, this will do the trick. I will also make a follow-up video and focus on detail how we can create our own lens flares in Affinity. So let's get started with this video. This is going to be a quick and easy hack. We will be using the amazing photop.com website. photop.com is a free Photoshop clone running in a browser. So let me first switch to Safari for this. As you can see, this looks quite familiar, especially if you have some Photoshop experience. We can create a new document from the file menu. I already created a document. Next thing we want to do is to fill the current layer with black by using the paint bucket tool. Creating the lens flare in photop.com is super easy. Go to the filter render menu and select the lens flare option. You have the choice from four lenses. Brightness and the positions of the flare can be customized. Pretty awesome. Once you're happy with the result, press OK. Last thing we need to do is to export the lens flare we just created from photop.com to a PNG file. This will start a download and your lens flare image will be stored in your downloads folder. Let's switch back to Affinity and turn off the lens flare we used earlier. If I now drag and drop the downloaded lens flare to this document, it will be loaded into Affinity. Final step is to adjust the position and set the blend mode to screen. There we have it. Pretty cool, right? That's it for this video. If you're interested on how to create the lens flare in Affinity itself, please don't forget to subscribe so you get notified when I release the follow-up video explaining how we can recreate the same effect in Affinity. Thanks for watching.